Hello. All right, so in this video, we're gonna quickly open up some Hot Wheels that I found recently. Most of you guys will probably already have um, all of these. If not, um, you've seen them. So probably the most notable is going to be the five pack, the Speed Blur five pack that did just come out, but it has the highly sought after Datsun 510 wagon. So first I'm going to open up the 50th favorites though really fast. So we have the 65 Ford Galaxy with the Gulf livery. This is a fairly large car. It's, um, the proportions on this casting are pretty cool, but it does have the Gulf livery. And be on the lookout for the Golf series that is coming, that Hot Wheels has coming out. Um, Lamley previewed it, and I'm not quite sure when it's when it's going to hit stores. It's not around me just yet, but be on the lookout for it. So then we have the 78 Dodge Little Red Express truck, and the tires seem just smaller on this one. I'll have to pull out a Little Red Express to see if this matches up to the mainline die cast, but. There you go, there's this one. It does have some tampos in the bed, so that's kind of cool, the wood wood tampoing. It does have the wood on the back. So this is a highly detailed casting, and I can see why it was pretty popular. We have the 55 Bel Air Gasser in purple. Have not been able to find the Kroger exclusive black one yet, which was supposed to be exclusive to Toys R Us. Um, I have a feeling that since Kroger got Jeffrey's toy box, that they will they were able to get the black one that was supposed to be for Toys R Us. And since Kroger picked that up, um, I don't think it's hit my my area yet. Nobody I know has found the black one, so I'm still going to be on the lookout for that one. But here it is in purple. Um, it's got the green windshield, green roof, the big deal. 55 Bel Air Gasser, so it's a pretty cool car. Last up is the 69 Camaro, and we'll open that one up. So I've opened all the rest of the 50th favorites that I've that I've acquired. You'll notice I don't have the Volkswagen van. I'm just not a big fan of that casting, so I didn't pick that up. The rims on this one look amazing. It's actually has a uh, kind of a pro street kind of. Um, what is that called? It's kind of late when I'm making this video, so I can't remember, but the, uh, the rims do look really good on this, this car. It's got the white top. All right, so then we're going to go to the main line ones. We've got the Hot Wheels Flames with the 70 Chevelle SS wagon. Just a quick car to open. And there it is. Looking good. This casting is always pretty cool. Doesn't have the rear, large rear tires, but it does have the steely rims for, so definitely something to look forward to on this casting. And we have the 67 Shelby GT500, part of the Flame series. This is an awesome car as well. Ooh, that one escaped. There it is. Uh, this is definitely one of the beefier Mustangs that Hot Wheels has made from the front end. This thing is large and in charge. Certainly not scaled uh, in the smaller sense. Then we have the Diamonds Are Forever 71 Mach 1, 71 Mustang Mach 1 from the Bond movie. This one's pretty cool. There it is. I believe they came out with this one a long a while ago, part of the Bond set. So it's nice to see it back. I think the, the rims are a little different though. And then probably my favorite out of the bunch is the Detroit Speed 65 Mustang 2x2 Fastback. This Detroit Speed is just amazing. I, they're, that is an awesome company. And they make awesome vehicles. And this is actually kind of like a white satin finish. Yeah, this is definitely my favorite of the bunch. Probably the coolest, coolest car this year thus far. I just really like Detroit Speed. And the purple on camera looks amazing. It looks better on camera than it does in person. If you find this one, it's definitely worth getting. It's probably going to be a dime a dozen. There's going to be a lot out there, but it's definitely worth getting. So last up is the Speed Blur 5-pack 
with the Datsun 510 and then the GMC down at the bottom. So I'm gonna quickly open up that. Five packs normally give me a bit of a problem on camera, so I'm gonna try to make this quick and simple. There we go. Got it. All right, so here we go. Well, let's save that for last. Then we have, first up we have the Dodge. I think, what is this, the Rampage, I believe. Or M M33, I forget what this is called, but it is a Dodge concept vehicle. Uh, this one's in satin pink. That's a nice car. We have the, I believe this is a Sandblaster. Let's see. The Dodge XP07, that's what it is. Man, I can read the back of the package. That's smart. All right, so then we have the Team Hot Wheels Corkscrew. It's a pretty cool car. We have the Monster Dairy Delivery. So that actually isn't a bad casting. It's pretty clean. It's not too, too busy. I like that one. Then we have the Custom C3500. GMC or Chevy and I remember when this casting came out I think it was 98 that was awesome that teal truck that was one of my favorite trucks It'd be cool if they could incorporate a dually I don't think they ever will but this one actually would look amazing with steelies on the back all right and then lastly is the 71 Datsun 510 wagon and it kind of has the Japanese graphics on the side, gray wheels. It's a pretty cool car. I think the top is actually the most appealing part. There you go. So there's a couple Hot Wheels recently, the 50th Favorites, um, the Speed Blur 5-pack, like I said, most of you guys have probably already seen these or found these. Um, if not, let me know. Let me know what's in your stores and happy collecting.